our Commonwealth Games uh, media manager and as well. We also have, uh, of course, now moving to the other end, and they are also members of the uh, Coordination Commission who have been visiting Delhi. What is clear is that the massive work that's being done now ought to have been done before, but what we are concentrating on is how to get things ready for athletes and officials who accompany them so that they can enjoy the best conditions possible for participating in the Commonwealth Games, which open on October the 3rd. Whilst we acknowledge that this effort has been done, we are, of course, very concerned that the effort will continue and the momentum that has been achieved over the past few days will continue, and not just until the <coughs> teams arrive in the village, but also sustained right throughout the period until the end of the Games. We have uh, Chris Jenkins, who is the chef de mission of the uh, Wales. I'm very pleased, however, to note that since that time, a considerable amount of work has been done, and that work continues. Yesterday, I attended a meeting of the chef de missions who were present, those who are here already. And at that meeting, reports were given on what had taken place so far, the work that was being done, and how the remedial work would continue. The chefs were very frank and forthright, and brought up points that still related to a number of problems that still exist. These, of course, centered around the cleanup of the village, and that continued and continued throughout last night. And later on this afternoon, I'll be doing another inspection of the village myself, in addition to receiving the reports that I have been given since this morning. Suresh Kalmadi. Uh, we will 